Skeebs. Pack and the president are like this. Oh dear. Oh my. It's the president. Hi, Mr. President. Uh, hello, Pack. I may be a tad late. No problem, sir. Actually, there is a rather large <laughs> problem. <laughs> Is back. Ghost chomping at his feet. Pack's our hero. Pack just can't be beat. Yeah! Pack that yellow packy string. He's a chowing down machine. Yup, monster goons. And only one can stop him. Pac-Man rules. The pack is back. Ghost chomping at his feet. Pack's our hero. Pack just can't be beat. The pack is back. Give me an idea. Let's see. Uh, bouncing berry? Uh, that's a growing berry. This eh, looks like pocket lens. Aha! The minty ice berry. Ghost of a chance. I'm in. What was that? Did you say something, Mr. President? <clears throat> Me? No. Everything's just perfect. That's strange. They all just suddenly gave up. Yeah, well, uh, at least the president's safe and he can talk to the class. Please welcome President Spratos Spheros. Right. I'm history. But, Mr. President, you said you'd stay and answer our questions. Go oh, stop whining. I'm a busy commander in chief. Oh, yeah. They're real close. That was seriously strange. Totally. Especially after you just saved him. Maybe he's just stressed out after the ghost attack. No! Move it, butler! Can't you 
see I'm trying to talk to the other twin twit. Well, Dr. Buttocks, have you found anything yet? Listen, Betraeus. I'm searching as fast as I can. Well, search faster before someone sees you. So what did they do? All they're going to see is their witless president's Spheros. They'll never notice my latest brilliant device, the Corporeal Occupation Extenuator, which allows... Which allows a ghost to possess a living being without time limits, as you told me a hundred times. Well, it is my latest, greatest invention. Yes, <coughs> hooray for you. Now stop bragging, Dr. Bollocks, and find out where my gimbal brother hid the repository containing our bodies. No! You think you can do better? Then why don't you come up here and possess your brother yourself? <laughs> don't be absurd. I'm the ruler of the netherworld. I sent others to do my dirty work, like you. Mind your tongue. May I remind you that I am the president? Rubbish! You're just in his body. And I can do whatever I like to it. Stop that! Stop that at once! Why should I? Haven't you heard? Possession is nine-tenths of the law. Don't confuse me with fractions. Just find that repository with our bodies! Oh, be quiet and let me think. But I didn't say anything, Mr. President. Ah! The Pac-Man! I mean, ah, oh, Pac. What do you want? I came to ask... Are you mad at me? Mad? Oh, um, no, I'm just, uh... Don't make excuses to that gluttonous gumball! Don't take that tone with me! I won't take any tone I like, you pompous prig! How dare you speak to me that way! But I didn't. Oh, leave me alone, will you? Um, I'll just come back later. No, you stay right where you are. Okay. No! Get rid of him at once, and then go and find the repository! Well, what if I don't want to find the repository, huh? What if I want to find the Tree of Life? What about that, huh? Huh? Hmm. Now listen to me, you egotistical ectoplasm! You insipid spectre! You waddling wraith! You impertinent idolin! Uh, you talking to us? Cause, cause if you are... You're gonna need to translate. No! Yes! I mean... Butler! I told you to clean the screen! I am uh, very, very busy, uh, but also not doing anything. Uh, nothing happening here, no sorry. Now, Scoot! Uh, but you sent for us. I did? Well, I changed my mind. So out, vamoose! Get... He's even nuttier than usual. I didn't think that was possible. <laughs> See ya. <sighs> Maybe he's just upset about all the recent attacks and stuff. But then why was he going on about the repository and the Tree of Life? No, no, something is definitely wrong. Yeah, dude, you keep waking me up. Did you hear that? I was trying not to. Not me! Listen! <laughs> what are you doing out here? I heard something. The roof! Oh, come on! Come to our room. What did I say? Hey, the joy could be bugged or, or slugged. Okay, whatever. So, what did you want to tell us? Oh, yeah, uh, that we, and by that I mean you, have a huge problem. We're talking build a monument to it huge. What do you mean, Betrayus was nuttier than usual? I didn't think that was possible. Hmm. He was ranting and raving at himself! I'm telling you, he's gone off the deep end without a paddle, pal! Talking to himself. Hmm. Just like with the president. 
Atreus and the President are brothers, right? So maybe they both flipped out at the exact same time. Or maybe the President is possessed? But he can't be. You said ghosts can't stay in a person more than a few minutes. Right. Or believe me, we would. Ew. We need help figuring this out. Who do we know who's an expert on acting weird? Good morning. Come to visit Fuzzbits, I presume? Actually, Circumference, we think the president's been possessed by a ghost. A real spaced out spook to boot. Fascinating. Uh, Okie dokie. Let's see if this works. Uh, did you hear what we... enough? Don't even think about it, Tintush. What was that? I call it the Paco Strobo Cacophonator. Oh, what's it do? Besides make us want to smash it. Well, you see, sometimes I build inventions to solve a problem, and sometimes I... You build inventions to cause one? Yeah, it's a wacky world. Right. So, what are we going to do about President Spiros? Ah, that's him coming now. Good. No, bad. He's... Talk later. Hide now. Ah, circumference. <clears throat> I mean, uh, circumference. Perfect. Get that old coot to tell you where he hid the repository with our bodies. But be subtle about it. So, circumference. I was wondering if you could remind me... Hey, look at this lab! I've never seen anything like it! But you were just here yesterday. Oh, yes, well, I simply love what you've done with the place. <laughs> Ugh, what a twit! Such interesting inventions. As president of Pac World, I order you to tell me exactly what each one does. <laughs> oh, happy to, <laughs> if I could remember. Ooh, what does this do? You're going to blow it! Never mind, I get the idea. Quit playing around, you pinhead! Stop pestering me! B but I didn't say anything. Do I look like I'm talking to you? Would you? Yeah! Oh, yeah, he's lost it. Ask him about the repository! I will do as I please! Of course, you're the president! Sometimes you have to wonder how the heck you got elected. Well, at least give me a hint. Fuzz, wait. He obviously senses the president is a fake. Uh, a monster! Uh, get him off of me! Get off! Oh. What are they doing here? Oh, let me see. Uh, hmm. Uh, well, they came to tell me something, and, uh... Run! Security! Sound the alarm! <laughs> I've been attacked by Pac-Man and his cohorts in crime! <laughs> Get them! Let's hover! Chased by the pack police! I can't believe this is happening! Hey, come on! We're the good guys! Honest! Forget it! We gotta ditch him! Right! <laughs> oh, hi, Fred. Funny running into you. We 
gotta hide! Oh, but where? Bro, I'm not even sure where we are. I am. This is a super cute boutique tube stop. Follow me. <laughs> Looks like we lost him. <sighs> we'll have to lay low till dark, then try to sneak home and get my backup berry supply. Hmm. Does this make me look fat? Citizens of Pacopolis, it is with a heavy heart that I must report to you that I, your beloved president, have just been viciously assaulted by Pac-Man and his two fiendish friends. Anyone seeing these three dangerous fugitives must notify the police immediately. These criminals must be brought to justice. Or to coin a phrase, gotta catch them all. Must make a secure call. Initiate audio isolation. <laughs> Don't just shut the partition. Atreus, are you there? <laughs> yes, of course I'm here. Where have you been? Arranging for Batman to be branded as public enemy number one. Ooh, good one. Uh, but what about the repository? Yes, yes. But I've got an even more brilliant plan that will lead me straight to our bodies and the Tree of Life. <laughs> While forcing the Pac-Man to surrender, or else. <laughs> brilliant! Glad I thought of it! Then while you're taking credit, make sure you think of sending up a battalion of ghosts to back me up. All right! Another brilliant idea of mine! <clears throat> All right, lower the glass. I, I said, lower the glass. Lower the glass, you fools! I'm really proud of you. I wasn't sure you had the willpower to keep from eating your emergency backup berries. <laughs> uh, me either. Dude, how many? There's one left. But that's better than none, right? You bet it is. So now what do we do? You could give up. But that would spoil the fun of watching you be wiped out. As president of Pac World, I command you to hand over your power berries. And then you are going to tell me where the Tree of Life and the repository are hidden. Am I clear? Yeah, but you're not the president. If you were, you'd know where the tree and the repository were. Of course I'm President Spheros. Prove it. Ah, ah, me, ah, ah. Don't panic. Spheros is my brother. I know everything about him. Here's what you tell him. My nickname in preschool was Faucet Nose. I wore a diaper until I was six, and please give me gas. There. Satisfied? Oh. Uh, uh, can you say too much information? Yeah, but pretty convincing. Except the real President Spheros would never team up with ghosts. He's got us there. It doesn't matter. I've won, he's lost. Go on, tell that lemon tart that Atreus finally beat him. Oh, fine, if you insist. Huh? On what? Hey, wait! Your voice! That's right. I am really the beyond brilliant Dr. Buttocks, who... Stop talking about you! This is all about me! Oh, all right, all right. You lose, Atreus wins. Reality check. Never happen, imposter dude. I 
beg to differ. Now hand over your power berry dispenser, or Sir Kumquat gets it. <laughs> oh, okay. Just don't hurt him. You can have my berry dispenser. <gasps> right. <laughs> At the last, the power is mine! What's wrong with you? It's mine! Mine, mine, mine! Whatever! Great. Where are the power... I am so going to... Star. Lucky he didn't have time to give the pack with Strobel Cacophonator back to Sir C in the lab. Time to gobble some ghosts! No need! Check it out. Let's book out of here! Oh, Dr. Heine had slime! Uh, game over, man! Game over! The pack is back! Pack. Silly. Spiral. I have already announced to Pack World that it was all a big mistake, and you are still our faithful heroes. Well, it looks like I need to get to work inventing something to protect the president from another incident like this one. Oh, uh, uh, by the way, while my diabolical brother was putting words in my mouth, I didn't say anything embarrassing, did I? Nah, no way. Don't be silly. Oh, good. Now, who's hungry? I am. Sure. <laughs> you bet. But don't worry, we won't order peas. Why, what? 